It's all happening. The big it game is. today. It's uh, Enigma versus OG. Yeah, he's getting a great farm, though. Like, yeah. already has 11 CS and has this wave coming. This is uh, what you need is bottom lane Kuro, the first to go. Like, I, I talked before about how, like, the dagger isn't actually, like, a great combo aggressive-wise compared to how we always see this, like, you know, Coddle plus one fighting people like PL used to. But it's cool to see them blast the wave and then nuke it with Spectre for the CS. Totally. Fortunately, uh, yeah, that that's Coddle right there. <laughs> yeah, totally. Meanwhile, Weeha down bottom here, battling it out with Topson. Who's going to blink first? Ghost walks to walk away. Oh! On the other side, they take him down. Are you kidding me? Dude, what a freaking play. And Kuro's going to fall also. Talking about, like, I feel like you need to make moves with Topson to try and okay. shut down this. This is amazing. Toss darks here. Like, they're crazy. This is really cool because we haven't seen a lot of darks here, but we've been looking for heroes that can do this. Yeah. They can go in and punish stacks. And we talk about the Iron Shell combos. It's sure it's great at killing heroes just like that, but cool. we haven't seen anyone do this where they're getting uh, stacks stolen. And this is the move they needed to make. Really well played. Mid one takes the kill on both of you them. Stuff them up. <laughs> and come in and just gobble those guys up. They steal your stacks. No, they can't do anything else here. Uh, Soxa went a little too deep. A little bit more vision. Oh, hey, look. <laughs> it's more stacks. <laughs> no, guys. Unreal. Oh, Weeha's going to try and take them all with the tornado, aren't you? Unbelievable. Lina. Yeah, there's an ancient stack too, but they, they can't really handle it. No Tail's like, oh no, my stacks. No. Team. Oh my god, they've taken so many from him. That's frustrating as heck. He's still stacking these ancients though. Uh, block it. We hot. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> what a guy. <laughs> he's like this idiot. <laughs> now he's going to be like, oh, they warded. <laughs> no, they still take the rune. Too, or else he like, definitely would have uh, put the sentry right in the middle of the camp and then right. just denied it after, and then they would have lost their odds. Roar. And on to him right at the start. They're going to blow up Lena. No chance at all. Meanwhile, the reality over to the side. Weeha trying to buy a little bit of extra space Oh, there. the cookie. Oh, nicely done. <laughs> right over the ice wall. I'm not going to be able to make those snipes, but man, mid one is staying greedy. You got Salve coming out or something? Yeah, he's got Salve and Clarity. He's staying on that map. Excellent stuff there. So they should get this haste rune stolen away from the smoked up Nigma, hopefully. Yeah. No Han available, so they got to go. Make things happen. Good Chrono there. Catches on to both. Are they going to be able to deal enough damage? Light Strike Array going to land. Vacuum back afterwards. Tops it. Down very low HP. They're already buying back onto one. Kuro brought down low by Soxa. Able to get that kill. Will Wisp down. My control trying to back out of there. GH still got the Iron Shell on him, but no more Snowball means he's going to get beaten down to death. I like the idea that you're talking about of like it being a good Radiance Dead game, but simultaneously, it's a Dark Seer on Nygma. Uh, so being able to get that as the wall is dropped on down and turns it back in, Vacuum pulls him in closer. GH, hook shot on the other side. They're able to find him. Weeha is in a little bit of trouble there. Can they do anything else afterwards? These illusions go into work as Weeha tries to back away. The dust is already there. Oh, the slow down with the time dilation, and that's going to be enough to keep Weeha alive. Well played. Yeah, he, he knew there was no getting out of there, so he might as well try to go for the kill. Got surprisingly close, considering it was in the middle of three and four, and then eventually four heroes. But now Seb caught with the snowball. Keeps going. Laguna Blade, Roar, turn around mid one, trying to take down GH, but it's a little bit too scary. They're bringing in No-Tail, trying to buy some space for their carry to get out of there. Enigma are not backing down. Tornado barely off the mark. And it looks so like, on. wait, is Kuro dead? They turn around. Okay, Mortimer's kiss is the battle does not stop. It never stops. Not for the next like 10 minutes or so, right? Like this Roche is just very important. This miracle, look at this good positioning. Jumps in, he wants Chrono it. there, onto two, Han afterwards on the backside, trying to bring him down. That's Radiance completed as well. Kuro just gets eviscerated here. Mind Control diving in really deep, drops down the wall. The snowball's going to go through the other side. GH still alive as Seb will fall. They throw in No-Tail, doesn't hit, but a big cookie afterwards. Going to land onto all of them. Miracle tries to jump away, seeing if they can get mid one into that wall but mind control just gonna have to surge out of there try and escape bottling up the whole time through with the radiance burn ticking him down and i think mind control might finally end up falling here as mid one is within range has another dagger and oh oh he's gonna bottle up though oh my god no I can't do it <laughs> yeah we'll burn all the mana oh, as oh, wait. oh no okay miracle has mana again and miracle diving in really deep got to be careful We'll throw out those axes. Roar is on cooldown. Oh, no. Hook shot in. Gonna land onto one here. Oh, good dodge away afterwards. But can they make it work? Weehan, a lot of trouble. Good disarm. 
seeing if he can make himself out, but there's going to be the Goblet spit out. Weeha trying to walk away, but all that damage over time is just too devastating. Vacuum wall onto all of them? They don't have it. They didn't have the vacuum back up again. He used wall. it to try and save the Invoker. Oh, and a double kill for mid one as everybody else is getting ran down. GH just trying to back out of here. Enigma don't have their pipe up yet. Like, well, no tail. Gonna drop the ulti there. GH, lots of damage done, trying to back away here. A DD on mid one, disarm. Leha trying to back out of here, but he's in a ton of trouble as all the Mormers kisses are landing. He's able to back away. So still nobody dead yet. GH is gonna get ran down to the side though by mid one. So trade one for one. Miracle has eyes on him. The Chrono's available and gonna try and bring him down now with the Alacrity. It's still so much damage being dealt back. Vacuum wall onto him, they get the kill. Seb now also being beat down. They're able to hit Weehaw on the backside with the gobble up. And meanwhile, the jump through, Kuro trying to back away. Battery Salt still hitting him. The ice wall is down. Can they bring down any more of these heroes? It looks like they're gonna be able to chase down Soxa, but I think that's gonna be about the extent of it. Everybody else manages to escape. So a good turnaround there for Nygma. Complete the Manta. And then with his fresh drums on Seb, the team fights are going to be pretty brutal, along with the Roche, right? You think about, like, Desolate with those illusions, and oh. they're going to fire with the kisses. Another round. Do they have him caught in a lot of trouble? He needs to get it off vacuum again with a deafening blasted snowball. But they meanwhile drop down the Will-O-Wisp. Already dead is the Faceless Void. It was too much damage. GH is going to fall and looking for more again. Man, been catching him constantly on this clock as Weeha gonna be revealed here, trying to jump his way through the cookie, the chase down, they got him, Weeha in trouble, and Weeha going to fall. Uh, also, has that Iron Shell giving the bonus HP, which is a pretty nice little thing for him. True. That's mid one, chasing Kuro down. Fight going on, on the other side. Snowball making a little bit of mayhem as mid one's trying to make his move over there. Soxa able to catch. A Miracle Double looking shot. for the chrono only onto one, but is it going to be enough? They'll take him down definitely in that chrono. Try and chase down No Tail. In the meantime, Weeha finds some time for the rest of his team. <laughs> they take down GH. Soxa double cogs him. Uh, mid and top and a tier one up here as well, which is about to go down, but. Uh, Soxa almost has <gasps> the overclock back up. What? They caught both of them. Oh that was my god, they need to do something here, but they've already lost Weeha and another there goes Kuro. by control in trouble to jump in. Dude, Sox is having the freaking game of his life on this clockwork. This yeah, he's playing amazingly. Owning. As uh, they will shard Roche for the scout. There's also a Quelling Blade Ooh. in there. Bonus item. Yo, big, big play, big play, big play. Oh, clockwork sees it though. Dangerous. He used his hook shot earlier though. Meanwhile, Haunt, mid one right, just jumped into everybody. Crazy. Mid one doesn't care. Mid one's did like, he guys. Did he that? Did he want to I think he might have. I think he did. Oh, Chrono on the backside. Find Seb. The hook shot in afterwards. The sun strike. Is it going to be enough damage? They're trying to bring him down. That's two already going to fall. Darkseer on the other angle. Wall has already been dropped. Miracle now turning on to mid one. If they can bring him down now, this would be huge. But the cookie, the turnaround was the same. Vacuum back. It is not enough. Triple kill for mid one. Someone on kill him. No AP. Ultra kill. As OG looking for another, and they find him. Just like that. Brilliant play yet again. And, uh, well, GH is gonna fall. Yeah, he just gets bored if he tries it, right? Oh, good hook shot in. Cogs pushed back. Mid one focusing on one. No, he pushed him out of it. Oh my god. Mid one is out of the chrono. And the jump through. Miracle trying to take down No Tail. It is not going to work. I do not believe as they pull back in mind control. And now the cookie catch onto both. Havoc hammer afterwards, everybody falling. Do they have enough left in the tank? The answer is definitively no. And with everybody dying, OG completely dismantling over the past couple of minutes, GG is gonna be called. Well played by OG. Just a, uh, a pretty solid game the whole way through. I mean, they took an early lead on all three cores. And, uh, 11 and two right now versus the eight now. Yeah, the Ember pick was really interesting. Uh, a classic Thompson hero for sure, but uh, not one that we see as often anymore, right? Ember has definitely fallen off uh, across the board, and it's not really a particularly like you know Ember counter pick style game either. It's, he's got Flame Guard in one. Oh, not got enough. him! Damn, what a play! Mr. Seb, come on, get in there. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, Apparently not. Pop up and feel the wrath. 
Oh, snowball away. Haunt in afterwards. Bring down Soxa and Seb in trouble. Good shards. Placed on down. Kuro dies on the other side of the map, but nobody cares about that one. Sir, they can those bring are down the air shards. Oh. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> not good. Not shards. good shards. <laughs> not good shards. I just, I, I want to believe the best in everybody, Trent. <laughs> I, I know, you're a little too positive sometimes. <laughs> uh, they're going to have more options just to be able to outplay Nygma in some ways. Yeah, it feels like there's like a big curve where eventually it'll come all the way back to Nygma. Right. Uh, but that's a long ways away. And Mind Control going to be pulled back in. Silence wears off, though. A chain away. Big shot from through. But there's no chance. Not really getting many favorable trades during this either. Pit of pressure on the bottom lane. Oh, mid one. See Libin? Gets the heal up. Jump through and actually able to turn this one. Weeha is low on mana right now. Tries to jump away, but oh, he's mid, on one, mid one. Chase down. Miracle wants to kill desperately. So many dodges, but eventually does die. I think that was the dispersion that killed him. So Tally ends up being the specter for. Oh my god, what? RPs? Pulls him back in. Can they keep him alive? Weeha living through it. GH trying to keep his buddy oh. out of there. He's actually surviving. Unreal coming through with the mech on the timber saw and now chasing down for Seb. Thompson trying to beat them down slowly as a lot of empower hits coming out from Thompson. The sleight of fist. Yeah, I was really curious what his item build was going to be. I've been trying to see what he wanted, like uh, oh. or Manta, right? Not enough heal that time. And they're going to bring... Oh, the snowball catches everybody. Oh, the turnaround. Now no Sick oh. stuff. And now Mind Control being brought down very, very low. Timber Chain's through all of them. Miracle trying to get away. Who do they decide to go for? They got their eyes set on Miracle. They want him instead. The root is going to be there. But then they see him down in Tyro. Oh, the no. save coming from Io. GH, the player. That was so rough because the RP was like five seconds away when they had that giant club and No-Tail could have skewered in to get the Timber and the Spectre. Whoa, they came back. Uh, oh, never mind. I saw, the, I saw the Spectre on the minimap and I got worried. <laughs> yeah. <All right. laughs> well, meanwhile, my Control getting jumped yet again. They don't stop. OG now finding Weeha needs to get out of there before Silence comes out. Oh, turn around. They pull down and take down Seb. Who else can they find? Skewer trying to buy enough space for Thompson to escape. I mean, we're going to have the Greaves, so I already You'd have that. Imagine that at some point he might get a Shiva's as well, too. Yeah. Uh, well, speaking of a lot of armor, it is going to be the Timber Saw. Mind Control trying to make his way out of there. Uh, All right, he's we'll still flying pretty to. fast. All yeah. right, never mind. We're good. <laughs> Game's okay. That was mostly Thompson, but I'll take it. Kuro. Able to give a little sidestep there, but that should open up the tier one towers. They pop exorcism for this one. Is this one. a tier one and Roche? Ooh. That the goal of this? That was that's... a very aggressive exorcism. Yeah, that's an interesting point. I um, think the glyph was just too much, though. Yeah, it's hard to do that now. Instead, maybe it could just be a fight. They jump in, silence there onto the PA, trying to kill off in time with the snowball. It's going to be there for the save. The RP afterwards, they destroy them. All right. Unreal. And now Miracle caught for the moment. OG fighting back in a big way. They're going to try and force them all down. My Control doing what he can to try and stop this, but they kill off Miracle. My Control wanting to bring down mid one. They're trying to protect their carry if possible, but My Control secures the finish. And that might save Roche from going the way of OG. <laughs> Meanwhile, Thompson's not done, though. Finishes off Kuro, too, for the triple. Yeah, that's a good point. He's going to retreat. I mean, they're probably just going to play back anyway because the Aegis is there. And the MC is trying to bait a fight, basically, by stealing this Ancient Sack, I think. Okay. Do they go on him? Seb. I don't think you want to be in here. He just got his Dual Scepter done, at least. They have a Snowball save nearby just in case things get dicey. Not going to pop that RP right now. They blow him up at the start. Now the jump in. They take down Sox as well. Both supports gone. Now mid one completely under control is going to get isolated and finished off. Hobson tries to jump away. But uh, Seb looks control. like he's going to be the one left behind here as he gets chased down and killed off. And yes, MC. Uh, that's bait, really baby. That was like bait, bait, bait. Like they're more focused on getting the lanes fully pushed out. Spectre goes up top and Weehaw's in. Again, low mana. Do they have anything to bring him back up afterwards? Trying to kill him off. Weehaw no tail. gets the zip away. No tail RP the duo in the back when they relocated in. They're not there to help. Weehaw's down. Oh my god. He okay. Just, he RP skewered them into the tier three. And now with nothing less, this fight's gotten incredibly chaotic. They've got him rooted for the moment by Kuro, but Kuro's gonna fall. Seb on the other side, trying to bring down Miracle. 
He still has his blade mail available as well as Aegis. So he is going to fall, but coming back in just a moment. They have buyback on Storm if they want to use it, but this fight, again, getting very chaotic. Still Io's trying to heal everybody back up. The good save coming out, and the Ghost Scepter is going to keep him alive. Now trying to bring down mid one. They almost have it. Is it quite going to be there? He jumps to the side, able to escape. Now the root on to two. Mid one living. Oh, he's, he's trying to he's life steal off of it. Haunt afterwards. He jumps away. Able to get out of there from the haunt. Oh! The snowball afterwards. And then they have to jump out. Thompson is going to get chased. Able to escape. Yo, mid one is an assassin, but eventually the mechanical monster brings him down. Well, they blow up no tail again. And meanwhile, on the other side, Miracle just trying to do what he can. This blade mail doing a ridiculous amount of damage. Can they kill the rest of OG off afterwards? My control playing cleanup duty along with Weeha punches him down. Thompson will fall. Seb, though, now trying to play cleanup duty of his own. He's got the silence on a Weeha with the heal coming in from GH and they get the relocate out. All right, he's good. Oh, wait, they're, they might bring mangoes. Yo, all these players are so freaking amazing at Dota. It's are we, are we absolutely going in, insane. Nah, GH is like, <laughs> he got this. Oh. So uh, they will chase down the IO. In the end, everybody dying, pretty much. And they have eyes on Seb. Dagger's going to land. Invis sucks in. In nearby. They have vision. Snowball is there. Oh, the silence, though. Oh, Doesn't man. have an answer for that one. And now Seb, in a world of hurt, he's gonna fall mid one, trying to do what he can. And they bring him down at all. Oh, I don't no know, tail, no tail. All of them RP, gonna land mid one. Do you have enough damage? The right click needs a crit, stolen RP. Never mind, turn it around. And just like that, or just find a target, jump on, no tail. Right at the start, no buyback. Used the last fight. Now looking for more. Hits the dagger onto both mid one and Seb, pops the blade mail. Mind control running through all of them. Look at that damage. Snowball, though, RP gonna be used afterwards onto one, and Ember falling oh so low. He manages to get the remnant out, but they take down mid one. They're gonna take down Seb. A triple kill for Weeha. They gotta go for a Hail Mary play. Yeah, they really do. Uh, RP still not for another minute, though. Oh, maybe another pickup on the curl here. They have a Yule. Buyback? Io? The exorcism's wearing off. Okay. Uh, this fight's getting a little bit weird now. Lotus on a miracle. I mean, the chase down's coming. They got to be careful. Mid one down to half HP, but he has Satanic back up again. Miracle turned upon the jump in coming from Weeha, trying to kill them off in time. They bring down mid one. That's the big kill they needed. Seb doesn't have nearly enough damage here. Thompson hoping to back away. No tail able to escape for the moment, but the dagger finishes him off as Nigma going to continue this unrelenting assault, trying to bring down OG Weeha very, very low, will not be killed. And now the chase down, the last little remnants of hope as Seb is going to be killed by mind control here. Miracle chasing him down as well. And the eventual finish with four dead. And oh, oh. oh. <laughs> what's the finish? No, it's not going to happen. It was a cute attempt. Uh, a draft that uh, is easy to doubt with how greedy it looks and the lack of control coming from some of these heroes. Like everyone played really well on Nigma. And he's going to get a haste. Okay, okay. Not bad at all. Oh, doesn't quite find a little remnant there. Does pull him back in afterwards now. Thompson forced to use the little sleight of fist. Oh, good root there. And maybe gonna find the kill on a GH trying to juke in there. Can they find this finish? On to Thompson, a couple more punches. Oh bottling up, he's taking so many tower shots. He can't get him. I think the only reason he lived is that he didn't actually get hit by the burn trail. Um, he already tried to zone back no -tail. I'm sure no -tail has seen that wards. So they're going to be keeping an eye on that. Mid one's in trouble. They rotated in. This is a huge kill for him. And it was super easy. Yeah. After a rather disastrous couple of games, we are now 4-0-1. Dude, he's killing it. And they get the root down now afterwards. Stampede tries to juke away. We still could chase. So many more astral steps. Don't die now. Okay, let's go. Mid one, meanwhile, caught in the jungle. They're gonna pop the egg right on top of him, trying to bring it down in time. The haunt afterwards, disruption couldn't save him. Mid one, gonna get saved there though. And Kuro having already popped his ulti, all this heal's gonna be coming through. Have they overextended? Meanwhile, my control tries to connect onto all. And they do the damage that they need to. Weeha has an astral step up in a second. Is gonna jump through, try and find the kill onto No Tail here. Beat down is complete. Weeha pulls him back in. Gonna oh, jump away, to assimilate out of there. And TP away, not gonna happen. 
as Thompson gonna get demonic perch here has the remnant back behind burrow trying to beat him down he's gonna get over to the rune they keep on chasing here purge yet again the supernova and then the taunt the combo is it gonna be enough will he get stunned jump oh, throw afterwards no. the makes it happen Thompson is going to fall and now the dive forward for more can they find another now he's taking no damage right he's gonna banish there on the alk and they bring him down afterwards they have anything else left in the tank he off to the side tries to get the remnant out it's not gonna connect There's first crown is on gonna MC. stun him up Greaves. He pops it, okay, and that's enough to survive. They have Pit of Malice available if they want to go now. Catching on to two. Weeha, though, is in, uh, and Weeha is dead. He got the kill on Soxa, well, with the help of Kuro, but they couldn't get the finish, and that's going to help them dive to MC. Oh, no, he stunned himself. Oh, Pit of Malice down. My control saved yet again. They're all underneath this tower, too, so getting that extra regen and everything else. Uh, they're going to lose Kuro now, and everybody else from Nygma needs to get the heck out of here. The Dark Rift is going to bring them away. Wow. God. Yeah, this 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 one's a, a definitely... It hurts. Pulling in. Hits onto Roche there. Supernova's actually down. So they do have Hong when they come back oh, up. Bad timing. And they get it. No mid one gets the Aegis. And the fear that Terrorize comes out at the perfect time. My control says, get me the hell out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. Oh. Does manage to escape just barely, but... They left one behind. The captain, poor old Kuro. Abyssal Blade just now done for mid one. That is scary. And the Aegis. Miracle has to be careful. Thinking about going for that back line. Hiding doesn't go on to get hit by the sun. A lot of damage onto the Ember though. Thompson in trouble, gets the remnant away. And now finding one Seb there for the stomp banishment afterwards. On to mid one. Can his illusions do enough? I don't think so. Underlord is going to fall. Well, they'll dive forward try and stop the rain of pain that's coming through from OG. As they will slowly but steadily take this tower, pop an ulti now. The glyph comes out and there's the disruption, but Seb, seeing his moment, gonna jump out there, finds him, Abyssal Blade for the kill. Seb almost goes down, but no tail, saving his save for the last possible second as the supernova is gonna go down now. Can they bring out any of these other heroes? Pull back in one. Thompson, they jump through onto both of them. Weeha able to dodge. He's going to be able to go for the astral step away, but the stun follows them. Thompson gets rooted. That's a great pit. Kills off Thompson. Can they find any more? Haunt chasing, trying to bring down Soxa. They have stun back up in four seconds. No tail trying to TP out of there. Will they get him? They bring oh, down one. Mid one, TPing away. He missed the remnant, but he get him. They get the kill. That is so important. If they can finish off this, this is huge. They didn't even get the tier three tower. Seb's That's nearby, why, though, waiting OG. for the jump. Looking for the jump. They got him controlled. Haunt is out there. Abyssal Blade and then the runaway. But the stomp's going to land, but it's not onto enough heroes. And now they might just lose another, but mid one, he has his ulti back. Is he going to live through this? Surely not. Now they pull him down. And now Seb, another one going to bite the dust. OG may have overextended. Enigma very gratefully are going to bear the fruit as they take down another. What a freaking turnaround. And GH and Miracle just hiding off to the side. Oh, mid one. Oh my God, he's going through the trees. He's going to find him. Abyssal Blade right there at the start. GH is nearby though. I need to pop the egg to try and keep him alive. The sun ray coming out. So much heals. This is actually great. Look at the freaking turnaround here. If they're not careful, they got to run away. They're going to try and bring down that egg. Meanwhile, they bring down Thompson. Kill him off. Dude, GH being off to the side there literally saved that fight for them. The Yule Scepter lift up onto Alchemist. Weeha's jumping through, trying to kill him. Mind Control has another pit back up in a second in the Firestorm damage. It's really hard to deal with this, but can they get away? They bought back on the Oracle. And the Ember too, so they don't want to commit too hard here. Ah, Chase Down has sick charges, but it's a lot of damage onto Mind Control. And Let him go, Kuro. Yeah, Let just him get away. Go. There's no way. And Kuro will be another one to fall here. But they kept their Spectre alive. Mm -hmm. Oh, walking up the hill. Finds him right at the start. Kuro able to live with that initial initiation. Look at the damage on the mid one. He's falling apart. He's getting destroyed. Mid one, he's just going to die. And now looking for more. No tail is down. This has been a catastrophe for OG. Uh, they're all going to fall here. 
Hobson goes down. No-Tail had to save himself. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, he just got rooted into the self-stun. And Battle. About, well, mid one, walking up the hill. They reveal him. Throws the no dagger No rush out. for Enigma. 20 seconds to haunt. No rush. Yeah. No fight. Away. Bad. <laughs> get away. GH is going to run. Doesn't want to get stomped by Seb. Stomp is going to be off the mark. Weehaw's there. He's finding GH. There's the stun. He needs to make sure he gets it off this time around. Danger, uh, danger. One. We'll get it. The root is there. Disruption afterwards. The supernova's already down. Can they bring him down? Yeah, that egg is mega dead. He's going to buy back afterwards. My control taking a lot of damage, but they won't bring him down as of yet. Meanwhile, Miracle tries to walk away for the moment. Weeha also backing away from mid one who got caught by that heal. Yeah, Already he too dead. This is dangerous. Oh, Tom pulls back in. That's a self stun. <gasps> the turn around. They got him. Oh my God, they killed him. What a freaking play by Weeha to catch him with that remnant free handed. Or perhaps smoking just stay around a little while. Yeah. Seb has 3,000 HP as he walks into them. Okay. Well, they actually it. scan the rest of them, so they know that he's not completely alone. Okay. Sunray's out there. Hard to go for counter initiation, but Terrorize is going to be there. Fear jumping all haunt afterwards. Can they bring him down in time? They kill off the Phoenix. No egg this time. They got a Oracle. to everybody, though, and there's going to be the Stampede. Damage reduction comes out. Miracle still trying to live through this one. Has the Aegis. Soxa going to be isolated and killed. Triple kill for mid one, though. Only two left alive. There's no buybacks on these heroes. Oh, my God. It, it How to win it. the fight. The jump in. The chase down. Seb needs to back away. He can't afford to die right now. But if they can bring down Miracle, this will be huge. And Kuro's nearby as the disruption or the save. But it's going to have to wait till afterwards. Round two uh, of this one. Yeah, they, they use it defensively. Out. Pull back in now. Catching on to mid one. Takes it off afterwards. Silence on to everybody. Long duration. Gets the kill. Mid one is taken down. And now they're looking for more. Steal the DD away. Beat the crap out of Thompson. And then try and see if they can find themselves another couple towers. They, they can't. I mean, the odds of blowing up Miracle are so low without the break. Phoenix just try, got a magic but... lamp. Seb oh, jumps that, in for the problem. stomp. Miracle's alone here. He's going to haunt. Jumps around. Who do they find? Up here on the top side. Trying to bring him down. It's a long duration stun. Can they Broken. kill him? The sun ray. It's so much heal. And there's the disruption from Kuro to save Bash? his life. Magic lamp. Yule Scepter lift up. Has the supernova afterwards. Going to pop it mid one. Getting brought down super low. They're going to kill off the egg, but they're going to lose their out. He does that buyback. Forced to use it immediately. Topson now trying to get away, but there's the Yule Scepter lift up. The remnant as he lands. And the beat down. Oh, but a good save there. Coming again from No Tail, able to keep them alive. They're all trying to get out now. And the Uber will keep them safely away. Who they jumping on? Topson gets the dagger on him. There's an Aghanim Scepter in Roche. Haunt, gonna be used. Oh, that's aggressive. Who are they going on? They find the backline Oracle. They got him. They know. They know that this is happening. And Terrorize. no Haunt. No Haunt available. Seb, they have Stampede with Aghanims around the Roche pit. How many times have we seen this, but they're going to take the fight to him. And again, they catch the Ember. Abyssal Blade, not going to work though. Thompson should be able to get out of there. BKB, but nobody got back. Light of Fist, mid one taking a lot of damage now as well. He's in a ton of trouble. They kill off mid one. No buyback for him. Two minutes dead. Enigma might have finally done it. The uh, the egg gets popped and he's got the talent. So it didn't even matter between the lamp. And now Fox is trying to delay things with his buyback. I buy back again there. Seb is going to be jumped on. Taunted pulled back in with the ulti coming from that Oracle. Everything that they can possibly do to try and stop this onslaught of damage. Another stomp in a second would be good, but Seb is going to fall. He's going to buy back as well. They still need 70 seconds out of this one as they're going to jump forward, find no tail, never give up, never surrender. But right now, OG is hurting as Nigma might have finally solved the problem and been able to come up with an answer as they chase down Seb, gonna beat him to death yet again. The stomp, the stomp's actually pretty annoying. Hard to deal with, but they'll just jump on him, kill him, and GG is called as Nigma take the series 2-1. Great job uh, factoring in the oracles this game.